Let's do another Meanwhile on Snapchat. And this one is a very special Meanwhile on Snapchat. Not simply because it is our yearly villain con video, but also because groundbreaking, we're going to be talking about time travel, how time travel works, how you can possibly do it, probably not, and how I have done it in the past. And as exciting as that may seem to you, I need to figure out something that's gone wrong. I'm going to do that now while you dive into the first video. Recently, in the future, I was made aware of something that I need to bring up now, in the past, so that by the time we get to the present, it will have been done. Now, you might not think that that makes sense in terms of how you understand time, but how you understand time is incorrect. How you understand time is how the scientists understand time. And you know scientists, I trust them about as far as I can throw them, so why would I trust them in terms of time travel? They probably don't even think it exists. But of course it exists. Well, it didn't. It would. It will. It hasn't. It won't. It will. Not yet, though. I need to do this first because, as you know with time travel, there's a loop going on. You need to loop back from a future point into a past point so that the loop can be completed. That's how the time travel thing works. It's a paradox. We're going to get into the paradox soon because VillainCon23 is here. And I'm talking again, of course I am, because last year was a huge success. And they said, Chris, you've got to come back this year. But this year, we need to up the stakes. We need to talk about something massive. And obviously, Hammerhead's gonna be there. And I was like, Hammerhead? Why are you inviting that loser back again? And I didn't actually get a valid answer why he's coming back. So we'll get to that when we get to the present of the Villain Con video part. This part's pre because I need to do this so that the time travel can work. I need to set the loop now so that when we get to the time travel part of the actual Villain Con thing that I'm gonna be speaking about, it's ready to be looped back. I don't know if you know this about humans, but we actually do live in a loop. Future humans have figured out time travel. They know how to come back, but it's a case of needing to connect up with something here so that we can create the base so that when they loop back, they come in through our, it's a long comp, I'm gonna get into it. I, I am gonna get into the details this year. When I'm doing my talk, I'm not gonna be wishy-washy, I'm not gonna be talking about clouds or anything ridiculous like that. I'm gonna get to the hard facts about it. But in order to do that, I've got to prepare things. And I never prepare things, you know that. You know I never prepare things. But I need to prepare this. So consider yourself prepared. Power of the horse. Power of the power of the power of the horse. Get excited, friends. Villain con. Power of the horse. Villain con. 23, right? Power of the horse. What's going on here? Something's weird. It's time, tra it's freaking time travel. It's the resistance of Justice Society, no doubt, hitting back because we've decided to take on the power of the horse, which is their motto. But we're taking it on. And they've hit us back with time travel. I don't understand. Something's changed. Something's wrong. I don't understand. I thought we were doing ideas. And where do they come from? And what happens if you don't grasp the ideas. It's gone. We're not doing power of the, you know, the Jackie. I can't even do the, I'm sick. What's going on here? Something weird is going on, but VillainCon23 will continue. We will prevail over the resistance of Justice Society. Mark my words. Stop me right there. Past Chris, what on earth are you talking about? Why have you done this time travel thing and why are you attacking the resistance of Justice Society? Also, you're not gonna answer me because you're in the past, except you're looping back to the future and by back, I mean, I'm confused. Is anybody else confused? Maybe the next video will explain what's going on. Initially, 
VolumeCon 23 was going to be a relaxed, exciting place for me. I thought I was coming down with some sort of sickness, so I was just going to take it easy. And then I got roped in by the resistance of Justice Society sticking their nose where it doesn't belong. And I had to take the reins. I'm like a cat, you see. Cats, eyes forward, looking forward. There was this bird one time, right? It saw a cat in the window, and it knew the cat couldn't get to it because this invisible force field was there. The cat on the other side of the window, it didn't get mad. It just sat there and said, okay, but next time I see you, I'm gonna pretend there's a window here. You're gonna make fun of me because I can't get you until you realize that I can get you. And that's what's happening with the Resistance of Justice Society. This is an Atlantis ring, but also an Atlantis ring is outside of time. So the Resistance of Justice Society messing with time travel, trying to get to me, I'm gonna plant, I don't wanna say a bomb, but let's say a bomb in the future that they're gonna get to. Give me a second, actually. Is past Chris the bomb? Is he looping back? Ah, I've lost the rings. I can't wear the ring, meaning I can't understand what he's going to do or has done or will do or something. Things are getting really, really messy. Let's try and tie up this whole villain con 2023 thing. What? I'm going to be honest with you. This isn't a brilliant time. Can, can this wait until day two? No, no. It cannot wait until day two. <sighs> Fine, give me a second. Now, now, now. Welcome to another Meanwhile on Snapchat. And a very special Meanwhile on Snapchat, of course, because it is my yearly villain con video. And this one is pretty good. Once you understand it, trust me, you start out mad and then you attack the resistance of justice society and then and, th and then you get to this point and then you need to actually smooth it over so that's what i'm going to do in this video you're not going to see it because you're going to see villain con starting now i need to end it this is the end of villain con for me because goodness grapefruits because there's loads that I need to go back and iron over. We're doing time travel. Some stupid idiot decided we should be doing time travel and past me thought that the resistance of Justice Society was doing time travel. So past me then used a thing that was outside of time and then he planted a bomb in the future which hasn't come yet, I don't think. As long as I go back and say, the horse, power of the horse. It's this thing, right? You know, the um, it's like a squatting thing. I'm sweating just thinking about it because like my legs are shaking. I can't even go further than this, right? But apparently if you like get down and do a power of the horse thing, I don't know. It's like the resistance of justice society's motto or something. I wasn't listening to the other guy who told me what to do, but I need to loop back to the start Make sure that this thing doesn't happen and then I'll get back to you. Not to you. To me, this is the end. This is the last thing I'm doing. The last thing I'm literally doing before the end screen. So you better start. I'm off. Cheers. This villain con thing was supposed to be about feeling and how you can feel happiness. How humans can pull from the river of life. Notice I said river of life. That's a future thing. But we need to get back to the time travel because I haven't figured out the stupid bomb that past Chris has done and I'm worried that he is actually going to do something to the resistance of Justice Society unprovoked. And when I say will do, it's past Chris, it's complicated. It is villain con 23. Oh, okay. I'm the one doing Nobody tells me anything. I feel like you should have told me. And I feel like I might have started something in the future with the resistance of Justice Society that we probably shouldn't have started. And I blame future Chris for this because I didn't know what was going on with the freaking time travel. We've reached the end of a time travel video, as ironic as that sounds. But what this means is, you can hit subscribe down below and then continue your journey with the linked video up above. Before that, let me play a quick 
2023 video for you to wrap off the year. Happy New Year. I trust you had a good festive period. Me, I was truly blessed to spend time with my family. One of the other gifts you can clearly see is that I have the knowledge that I can still tan in 10 days. And of course, the everlasting gift of being back in England in winter with the worst farmer's tan I have ever seen. Me, truly blessed. Spending time with my family, with my nephew, who is four. One of the lessons I learned over 2023 is the show Winnie the Pooh cannot be based on true events because you cannot shirt cock it. Trust me, from personal experience, if your todger is waving in the wind, that's gonna knock onto a corner of a table and that hurts. These are the kind of lessons we need to take into 2024 so that we can live our best lives. See you then. That's as good as it's gonna get. I probably should have been wearing my Villain Con t-shirt, but I am in the middle of a storm right now. Not mentally, I mean like a weather storm. Not the storm either, but a storm. So you're lucky I'm even here at my studio.